Sajida al rishawis final transfer. A convicted al-Qaeda bomber, the 44-year-old Iraqi woman was executed at dawn on Wednesday, along with another prisoner, Ziad Khalaf Karbouli. These were the first of several executions in retaliation for the killing of Jordanian pilot Muat al qasasbe Relatives of al qasasbe gathered in solidarity and sadness as the Jordanian government confirmed the pilot's death after a video reportedly showed him being burned alive by Islamic State militants. 26-year-old Kesaspe was captured by the Islamic State group when his jet crashed in northern Syria in December. The Jordanian government said last weekend that it would be willing to swap Sajida al rishawi for the captive pilot, but demanded proof that he was still alive. Pressure mounted as the militants released videos showing the beheading of two Japanese hostages. But it now appears that any negotiations would have been in vain. The Jordanian armed forces claimed that the video which shows a man in a cage being set on fire, was actually filmed at the beginning of January. This criminal gang was determined to put a tragic end to his life. They announced today the murder of our hero pilot, which actually happened on January 3rd, one month ago. Jordanian officials said they would avenge Kasazbe's death, and Wednesday's executions could very well be the first of many.